Hey everybody, Jeff here. Today is December uh, 23rd. Tomorrow is Christmas Eve. And I just wanted to come on here real quick. I didn't do a fireside chat today because of the holiday and there's a lot of people out. And um, I got a lot of great people uh, lined up for the end of the year going into the new year. Now, in case you're all wondering know what I'm doing, I'm actually uh, doing some more winterizing to my Jeep real quick. I had a few minutes to do it. And so I thought while I was doing this that I would... Um, talk with you guys and see how everybody's doing everybody knows that i'm a jeep person and i have to take these things out so i can actually see i got face mask hidden everywhere in here <laughs> um anyway i hope you guys all have a great christmas this year i want you to think about a couple things though when you're having christmas this year there's a lot of military out there but there's also a lot of men and women that for some reason or another you know they're they're just been depressed they, they're not doing so great, you know, but they're not reaching out to anybody, you know, they're not sitting there going out of their way because they feel like they are the problem, not any of the solution. So, there we go. I'm doing that because I got to check a thing real quick. And if they're, they, if they think they're the problem, that's, there's a lot of veterans get that way. And right now with the coronavirus and now all of a sudden they're talking like there's not going to be a stimulus bill because, well, let's face it, our government keeps failing us time and time again. And I say that for both branches or both parties and everything else. I don't trust any of the parties, but that's me for you. Personally. Now, does that mean that makes everybody bad? Nope. It just means there's people out there that are depressed. Uh, they're, they're looking for friends and allies, you know, they're looking for something um, that only you can bring to them. Um, sometimes it's just friendship, other times it may be, uh, I don't know, maybe just to go and visit, maybe they just want you to call them on the phone, whatever it takes, but that's what they're looking for right now, and it's funny because they're not going to reach out to you, you actually have to reach out to them. And it's very simple. They feel like they're the problem. And they feel like nobody cares because they've been in trouble. Not necessarily in trouble. They just feel like what they do is trouble and that they don't want to bring anybody else into their problems, into their life. Well, you can do good by these people by calling them up on the phone. Say, hey, how you doing? What's going on? You know, it's easy for us, you know, to basically be better people every single day. Yes, I know. I'm going to make people dizzy real quick. I'm trying to find my armor all so I can clean off some of the rubber before the winter kicks in. That cold and stuff, I tried to put a rubber cleaner on. All right, back to what I was talking about. So, basically, what you can do, call up friends and family. Let them know that they matter. Let them know that you care. Let them know that they're important. And it's simple that simple. Now, myself... I mean, I've gone through stuff all this year, you know, my, I am no better than anybody else, okay, and I'll tell you what, when I've had friends do things that know what I'm